Iron, steel, fire, hammers, it's all in a day's work if you're a blacksmith. Let's visit with a gentleman who transforms scrap metal into something amazing. Well, at one time it was considered the king of craft. The blacksmith made tools for the carpenter, tools for the doctor, shovels, everything. Now a lot of the blacksmiths either do uh, reproduction stuff, restoration for museums, uh, artists, a lot of artists, blacksmiths. My name's Steve White. I'm a blacksmith here at the Iowa State Fair, Pioneer Hall. I can make anything I want to think of. Hardware, candle holders, I make tools sometimes. I'm just playing. There's a puzzle element involved in it. It's puzzling it out where to start and what, what to start with. And that's, that's what keeps it interesting. It just starts with a piece of half inch square bar. And then you, you point the end and neck it down. It, I make these little blanks here. I have a can full of them. And then you draw the stem out, and then you flatten the leaf out and put the veins in. <laughs> Buy one, get one? No, they're, they're a Matt's pair. Are they new? Yeah, well, I've had them about 10 years, but I made them. Yep. Yep. Yeah. My stuff doesn't sell all that well. I'd be better off selling baskets. And hauling <laughs> stuff up here would be better, too. <laughs> And I'd, I'd be cleaner. I can't think of everything we fix, but it's always something. We'd make stuff for people in the campground. I repair stuff from eyeglasses to wheelchairs and everything in between. Slow start with the rain this morning? Oh, I, not really. Like I said, we're, we're a small family here for two weeks every year for over 25 years, most of us, the potters and the basket makers and the antique dealers. And so we're all friends. And so, a good share of them, that's the only time I see them is at the fair. But we're, we're a small family, two weeks a year. So I always enjoy that. It's fun, every time. Learn a lot from other people, learn a lot from books, and you never quit learning, ever. Very cool. Uh, I learn something every day.